When you typically ask an eighth grader, what do you want to do when you grow up? Um, they want to be a professional athlete. They want to be a blogger. What we want is for them to understand that those are all great options and we want them to follow their dreams, but we also want them to know what is available in their community. You don't want to be the one sitting in the back waiting on it to happen. You want to be the one designing that. You want to be the one doing it. Education Matters is a partnership with business, education, and government all working together to help kids in schools understand what kinds of jobs are available in our community and also what kind of education and training is available for the jobs that we have. Tracy started developing partnerships with businesses that we don't have time to do in the public schools. We know how important it is, and yet with all the hats we wear, and especially a small district, people don't have time to do that work. Oh, that's cool. Isn't that cool? Anybody else want to try? Go ahead. Yeah, you can send it over to anybody that wants to give it a shot. Especially in the STEM fields and the STEM career areas, for an engineer to go into a classroom and try to describe what they do, I think it would be very challenging for, for the students to really get the scope of what that means. The Extreme STEM Tour is an event that we do for every middle school in our public school system. They get to visit two businesses. They meet with representatives from the North Carolina Center for Engineering Technologies. They also come to the Catawba Valley Community College campus and not only tour but get presentations in the programs that relate to the businesses that they visited during the day. We get letters back from them all the time and you know they're writing I really liked this particular part maybe it was showing how a sock is made or I really liked our touch wall. The manufacturing industry is not like it was many many years ago it's changed and there's a lot of automation a lot of technology and for students to be able to see and hear and feel what that environment is like I think can be life-changing. We're proud that we're doing our part to change that image of the industry. Five years ago, I'd have had a real hard time getting an intern coming in to my, my particular area. The last two years, I've had people in the top two and three in the class coming to work in a manufacturing solution center. That's fundamentally changed our area for the good. I am amazed at the level our business community and our government leaders have stepped up to the innovative ideas of allowing kids into business and industry that had not been done before in this area. They are offering creative, fun, engaging experiences for the students where they can meet the people who are those leaders who they can come back to and say, I visited your company, I, I want to work for you, I remember what you said to us. Um, and you made a difference, and I'm really grateful for that.